opening up the outside door. Come on, get inside, get inside before anyone else comes. I love Fortnite. Logan? What are you doing, man? I just took out like three guys. Just trying to relax. Dude, you can't be relaxing while we're playing Fortnite. It's the best time of the day. Is that my cell phone? I haven't upgraded the new iPhone yet. Go for Papa JJ. Papa JJ, this is the general speaking. General, look, you can't keep calling us. We've already saved Fortnite once this week. Yeah, there's a, there's a once a week limit. That's not why I call it Papa Jake. You see, we have an extreme problem. Have you ever heard of something called a volcano? A volcano? What, what, what do you mean volcano? Like, like, it's gonna erupt? Yes, it's gonna erupt. And that's why you need to build a bunker so you can survive its eruption. Okay, yeah, yeah, we'll, we'll, uh, we'll prepare for it. All right, thank you for the heads up, sir. Okay, yeah, bye. Logan, we have a serious problem. There's a volcano heading this way for Fortnite and we need to build a bunker right now. Hey yo, what's going on guys? Papa Jake here and we are back with a brand new video. However, we might not be back for very long, Logan. There is currently a volcano about to explode. So guys, as you know, we were playing Fortnite. Everything was going great. And now the volcano is set to explode. And the only way we are gonna survive this volcano is if we can build a Fortnite vault. It's like Fallout Vault, but Fortnite edition. You guys all saw what happened to Bunker Jones and Mr. Banana Man. And that's gonna happen to us, Logan, if we don't make the ultimate vault. This thing needs to not only be super secure, we need to close this thing down, vault doors, seal off the windows, have a ventilation system, fireproof, food, water, lava proof. We need all of that if we are gonna survive this volcano and survive in this vault for 24 hours. Now guys, as you can see behind us, we've got a lot of cardboard. And we have a lot of forts going on right now. I can count one, two, three, four forts. This isn't a counting video, Logan. This is a survival video. Okay, yes, we have four forts. We need to combine all of these into one epic fallout shelter that we can survive the Fortnite volcano. And if you guys happen to be brand new to the channel, remember to smack that like button and the subscribe button as well as that bell button. All right, Logan, come on. We gotta start building this thing. The volcano's about to erupt. But guys, seriously, don't forget, smack that bell button. All right, so I'm thinking that we maybe make this the front entrance with an epic vault door and then board these windows up so we can create like an epic entrance. Okay, wait, 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 Jake. Why don't we make this the vault door? This should be the grand entrance. You go through this tube and then we build a fort there and a fort there. That is pretty sweet. This will be the entrance and then we can have this as an extension over there. And then I'm also thinking, guys, this could be like a living space. I mean, this needs a lot of fixing up, but this could be an epic two-story living space that we add onto the vault. Guys, look at us. Like, we're, we're like two box fort architects. Okay, guys, so we have been working on our Fortnite bunker for the last, well, five hours. In fact, we are getting extremely close to the volcano erupting, which means we need to huddle in here and survive here for the next 24 hours against heat fire, lava, and so much more. It might be a little bit too big. I mean, I mean, guys, we're trying to make this bunker like it is inside Fortnite, and we have combined over five different box forts. I mean, you guys can see just how many box forts we have, and guys, this is crazy. It might, in fact, be one of the biggest forts we've ever made. I actually don't think there's gonna be any challenge surviving in here for 24 hours. No, this is like a billionaire box fort. Yeah, I might come out as Bunker Jones, but I'm gonna be having a ton of fun. But first things first, guys, the entrance to our Fortnite bunker starts here with this extremely heavy blast-proof door. Okay, door's open. Now, not all the power's on. We still have to work on power, auxiliary running water. Ventilation system is online though, so we do have fresh air, you know, that we don't want to breathe in volcano air. Uh, the second panel here, deactivate the door locks and depressurize. And we can open this and head into the bunker. Ooh. We don't want anyone else coming in here. Guys, this box fort is so cozy. All right, coming into the next room. All right, so this is the first area. Obviously, we have a ton of stuff to do in here, guys. We still need to make these rooms even more awesome. Uh, this has a fancy light like this on the wall. You can turn the light on, you can turn the light off. We'll just leave it on for now. All right, over here, guys, we have two different ways we can go. So the first way is through another door. The more doors you have, the more secure. That's a hashtag Papa Jake fact. Jake, let's do that door. We're not going through that door yet, but this door. So you're probably in here, you're probably like, Papa Jake, you said this was an awesome big bunker. This don't look like billionaire. That's because it isn't. This is just the pre-billionaire part of it. So come on, we gotta keep going this way. It actually goes over here, guys, 
and has a secondary room. Just give me, give me a second, Jake. This place is like a maze. Come on, Logan, it's up here. It's the second story. We go up to the second story. Oh gosh. Okay. And here we are into the next room. Surprise! We're in the bedroom. So we still need to put our beds in there and deck this place out. I mean, it's not as fancy as a rooftop apartment in Tilted Towers, but it's gonna survive a volcano. Guys, this place is super fancy. So this will be where we put our beds. This is where we'll sleep. We also have these guys. So these are blast shield doors. So you can actually open them like this. And then let's say someone was trying to get into our bunker. We simply open up these blast doors, take them out with our scar, whatever weapons we bring in here. We also, I think we need to build like an armory, dude, so we can defend Ooh. this place. An armory would be sick. Cause yeah, guys, a lot of people are gonna be running towards this bunker when the volcano goes off and we gotta make sure that they don't get in. We only have enough room. I mean, technically Logan, we have enough room for like 50 people in here. We only have enough cool stuff for me and Logan. You're probably sitting at home right now in your comfy chair being like, Papa Jake, this is too much box for. I can't handle it. And I know, I know you can't handle it because this is the biggest box for whatever, but we got more, so you gotta follow me. Down we go into the next story. I think we should build the armory in here. Oh, that'd actually be sick. Yeah, we could definitely do that. We could bring all of our weapons in here, load it up with ammo. I mean, we could defend ourselves against anything. Oh, is that a volcano? Is it erupting? I'm not ready, Logan! No, I've been in this bunker too long. I'm gonna eat Logan. All right, I'm already going bunker crazy. Jake, we have plenty of food. Right, right, we have plenty of food. Okay, we won't die. All right, the bunker is secure. That might have been like the first little drizzle before it rains, but we are gonna be okay. All right, come on. We gotta continue this tour so we can start adding stuff to this. We don't have a lot of time. The next part of the bunker, it gets even bigger. In here, I mean, we still gotta get the lights going on, but check this out, dude, okay? This is the next area. Now, if you come in here, we don't have anything in here we yet. We spent literally all day building this By thing. By the time we show this thing, the volcano will have already erupted, so we gotta keep moving. All right, but once you get in here, guys, Let's we have a secondary security door. <laughs> wait, wait, what? Close this door, oh, like this. Now, this is a really thick and heavy door, and we're even more secure. There's like one, two, three, four. This is an accounting video, Logan. Five, we've got like 40 doors in this place, and the more doors, the more safe you are. Now, I was thinking, dude, we could make this like a gaming room or something. It could be where we store all our slurp juices. Not really looking forward to living off slurp juice for the next 24 hours, but anyway, we're not even finished here, dude. Come on. We got another second story to go to. All right, and we're going into another room. You come up here, I mean, this, Technically, it's just a hallway, but I mean, it's big enough to be its own room. Then you come down here, and we have one of the biggest rooms in the entire fort. Again, guys, we haven't done the lights in here, but this is another massive room. We got a bunch of storage shelves here made out of box. We got a table over here. Could be kitchen, could be storage, could be armory. I mean, we got so many options. This place is huge. Again, with the blast proof windows, we can open these up. You know, take out any bad guys that might be there. And guys, if you love these epic box fort builds that are just insanely massive, let us know by smacking that like button and maybe put like a hashtag Papa went big in the comments. Well, Jake, Logan went big too. No, no, no. Hashtag Logan went big. Hashtag Papa went big. Okay, hashtag big. All right, but what we need to do now, guys, is get all of our stuff and start filling this place in. This has probably been like one of the biggest box fort tours we've done in a while. But let's, uh, let's grab our stuff and get building. All right, guys, it is officially time to reveal our Fortnite bunker. We have completely filled it in and it is all ready for the... Sorry, someone's calling me on my cell phone. Go for Papa JJ. All right, General. Uh huh. No way. <laughs> uh huh. Okay. Yeah, no, I'll let him know. Yeah, yeah, I'll tell him. No, you too. All right, all right, bye. Jake, what's so funny? Oh, he's just telling me about his day. Uh, there's something else though. Oh yeah, the volcano's erupting! We gotta get inside! Oh, the volcano's exploding right now? We gotta get inside this bunker right now. All right, opening up the outside door. Come on, get inside, get inside before anyone else comes. Volcano's coming. Hey, do you like the music I installed here? It's like waiting room music. Jake, why is there waiting room music? We're in the middle of a why volcano. Why the second door? All right, second door lock. Pressurize and... All right, we're good, come on. All right, guys, we're now in the main room. Now we just sit and maybe, maybe party a bit. I can hear the music. I don't know if you can, but I can hear it. Jake, there's only so long I can last in here. Check. How long is this volcano supposed to last? I don't know, I'm not Google. But what I do know is we can boogie to the night. Jake, shouldn't we be locking down this door right now? Hey, get it, get it locked down. Locking down 
for it. Hand scan. All right, and we are officially. Okay, it's erupting. This is good. This is good. Oh, look at Jake. Smoke's getting in the ventilation system. I quickly into the armory. Door is locked. Hopefully, no smoke gets through. All right, guys, well, welcome to the armory. This is where we hold all of our gear and ammunition. Might as well gear up with the golden scar. Oh, it does not sound good out there. Here, why don't we go up to the second story where their beds are? Chill out there, we can look out the window. We're up now in our bedroom, which we've completely decked out with all of our comfy stuff so that we can be surviving for the next 24 hours here. As you guys can hear, the volcano is raging on outside, but we're relatively safe inside our fallout bunker. I think someone's outside. Let me in, let me in, someone's let me outside in. the bunker. He's trying to get in. Okay, Jake, we have to defend it. Let me in. All right, ready? Three, two, one. Nice. Jake, it looks like we have another one on the right. All right, taking him out. Hey, you! Got him, he's down. All right, quickly, get these windows closed. Ugh. Hold on, Logan, we got another one. Where is he? Hold on, hey, Jake! Get your own bomb in! Jake, I got a grenade of my own. Open that window. Three, two, oh. one. Chuck it! <laughs> oh, nice one, dude. Ugh. All right, well that should do it for now. At least people will know not to mess with our bunker. How long did the general say we'd be in here for? I mean 24 hours, but it could be longer. 24 hours, 24 days, 24 weeks, 24 months. Come on, let's go back to the main room. We got some stuff to do. All right, Logan, it looks like the smoke is completely vented out and all of the bunker systems are 100% online. We're good to go for the next 24 years. 24 years? I, I mean, or hours, or hours, we don't know. One of the coolest things about this room, Logan, is I brought us some brand new Beyblades. If you didn't know, Jake and I have a long-lasting Beyblade tournament, which I have won the last two games. No, you have not. Maybe you won the last two, but I am, I am overall one of the better Beybladers. We have a brand new Beyblade Stadium. I was about to say, Jake, I've never seen this. Yeah, well, we kind of uh, froze our last one in liquid nitrogen. Two, Two one, one let it rip! So, we got a brand new Beyblade Stadium and some brand new Beyblades. Kind of worked out. And we're going to be here for a while, so I thought, you know, we could have a massive tournament. Maybe like a 24-year-long tournament. Round one, pop Jake first, Logan. In three, two, one, let it... Two, two one, one, let it rip! Oh, the battle's on. Oh! Oh, dude, my guy's going crazy! Oh, and it looks like Logan goes down on the first battle. Let's go in three, two, one, let it rip. Oh, come on, buddy. Attack. Oh, come on, final, final blow, final blow. Destroy Logan. Oh, and it looks like Papa Jake has won this round of Beyblades. Logan, you're going to have to wait for the next video. All right, well, you won this round, Jake but I think it's time to play Fortnite. We can't have a Fortnite bunker without a complete Fortnite gaming setup. We got the Fortnite backdrop. We got some of these because you know, while you're in a bunker, you might as well have some nice decor. And Logan, you almost forgot. The extra secure blast shield uh, comes up for extra security. We are officially playing Fortnite inside our Fortnite gaming setup, inside our Fortnite bunker while the Fortnite volcano's raging outside. What more Fortnite could you want? Alright, Logan, I'm gonna I'm dip out for a second. You take over. I'll be right back. Where are you going? Nowhere. You take over. Play Fortnite. I'll be back. Alright. <laughs> 21 kills. And we won the game. So far, I'm having a pretty sweet time in this bunker. But Jake left a while ago. Like, 30 minutes ago. Jake? Jake, are you in the kitchen? Uh, yeah, I'm in the kitchen. Don't come in the kitchen. What do you mean, don't come in the kitchen? Jake, are you eating dinner? No, I'm not eating. I'm not eating dinner. Jake, there's french fries in your mouth. Maybe a little bit of french fries. Okay, yes, Logan, I'm hungry, all right? We've been cooped up in this place for a while. I want to eat dinner. And I realized a very crucial error on both of our parts. Guys, uh, as much as we packed a lot of really fun stuff into this bunker, Logan, we, we only brought two meals. We brought two Durr burgers and fries 
and we brought one thing for breakfast. Powdered eggs. I don't even know how you get them powdered, Logan, but I know they're not supposed to be like that. Eggs should be round and fluffy. Not powder. All we brought for food is two meals? I mean, I was in charge of the Beyblades and the fun stuff, like bringing Fortnite and the cozy stuff, like the beds. What did you bring? I brought this for lunch, but I thought you'd bring some food. Well, guys, this is literally all we have. Two leftover Dur Burgers, which, by the way, might not even exist anymore after the volcano hit them. Logan, stop eating the fries. Well, I guess uh, I guess it is time to have dinner in this 24-hour challenge. The volcano has hit. So far, it has been nice and cozy in this fort. Everything has been going smoothly. Uh, yes, we are extremely low on food, but we are technically stacked for dinner and breakfast. Although breakfast tomorrow is going to be interesting when Logan has to eat powdered eggs. But uh, let's uh, let's grab our Dur Burgers, eat up. We're civilized people in this bunker. All right, we're not Bunker Jones yet. We eat at the table, the box table. You brought plates. Of course I brought plates. We're not Bunker Jones yet. You could have literally brought anything else, like granola bars. This guy remembers plates but forgets food. I mean, it's more food than we have on most of our challenges. And we have slurp juice. Some good old fashioned slurp juice so we can make sure our shields stay fresh and our thirst stays quenched. Has currently finished dinner inside the Fortnite bunker. Logan is working on his Dur Burger. I'm saving every last bite. Currently, I'm gonna quench my thirst after that burger and raise my shields with some good old fashioned slurp juice. Tasty. All right, well, I guess it's time for us to head back into the bedding area. Let's go. Jake, what was that? I was outside, so I'm trying to get in. Why do you have a scar in our kitchen? In case the cooking goes bad. No one's home, leave now. This bunker isn't safe. He's trying to get in the front. I can take him out right now. Hey! <laughs> I just missed my head. Quickly close it. Get him? Don't let too much volcanic ash in. Oh, yeah, I got him. Ever since we put up this bunker, everyone's been trying to get in. Okay, well, it's been a long day. I think it's time to hit the hay. Yeah. All right, let's lock down the bunker and get to bed. I'll meet you back in the sleeping quarters. All right, guys, time to fully lock down the bunker now. I'm gonna put it into a secure lockdown mode so no one can get in during the night and an alarm will set off if someone tries. Now for the hand scan. Perfect. All right, we should be good to go. Now time to head up to the sleeping quarters and meet up with Logan. All right, guys, we are now officially inside the cozy bedroom. Oh, Logan, buddy, how did I beat you here? <sighs> May have played one more game of Fortnite. This is our official sleeping quarters. I mean, it's pretty cozy in here, dude. And we got our pet llama, George. Come here, Mr. George. We have built one of the biggest and craziest box for bunkers, and we are now surviving in it. It's been pretty easy so far. I mean, we kind of made this place like a billionaire box for it. So honestly, I can't complain, even though the apocalypse is going on out there, even though people have been trying to break in. I'm just happy to be cozied up in here with George. Jake, check this out, ready? Yeah. Three, two, one. What? Clap on, clap off lights. Oh, cl clap them on again. <laughs> what? Okay, okay. Guys, we're going to bed. Good night. What's going on, guys? There's another lit day in the box, boy. Logan, wake up. It's morning. Guys, we just woke up. It is officially morning after surviving 24 hours inside the Fortnite bunker. We might have another 24 years to go, so this is day one down. It's morning time. No. It's more time to eat breakfast. No. I'll race you to the kitchen. Let's go. Honestly, guys, this is one of the comfiest forts we've ever had. I actually had no problem sleeping in here, and it was extremely spacious, uh. which I loved. So all in all, this has been a pretty sweet bunker. I think we actually outdid ourselves. We did a pretty good job of recreating the Fortnite bunker. Logan, it's time for our Fortnite breakfast, so I don't need to in the kitchen. I'm gonna just stay here. No, Logan, it's time to rise and shine. Beautiful day inside a bunker. You do kind of get tired of looking at cardboard all day long, but honestly, I really like this thing. The only thing this is missing is being outside. Guys, I gotta say, this is one of my favorite forts. Also guys, if you think we should not tear this down and actually continue it, like, add on to it and make it even bigger smack that like button let's try and crush 25,000 likes and put a hashtag keep it in the comments so we know you want us to expand it now as you guys know logan did not bring enough food so all we have for breakfast oh logan 
You made it. I'm so tired, <laughs> Well, Logan, I'm gonna cook you some breakfast, and uh, since we are surviving in a post-apocalyptic bunker, I guess all we have is powdered eggs. And also, Logan forgot to bring us water. So the only drink we have is slurp juice. So I'm literally making powdered eggs with slurp juice. Also, you're supposed to boil the water. Did I mention that? But we have no way to boil it. We have a kettle, but no way to boil it. So, uh, looks like Logan's gonna be eating this one. Oh my. Well, it definitely looks like survival food. I've never seen eggs like that before, but uh, that's what we got. All right, time to add our slurp juice and cook this up for Logan. All right, now that the eggs have the slurp juice in, we simply shake it up like so, and they should start to expand. Jake, what are you doing? And in just a few seconds, we will have some delicious breakfast eggs, Logan. No. Inside our Fortnite shelter. No. Oh yeah. No. It's your forks ready. Jake, why would you do this? You ever heard of green eggs and ham? No. All right, Logan. No, Jake. This is yours. <laughs> oh, no. Oh no. I can't even be near that. Could you not have brought more food? That smells so bad, You should have brought more food. That's all we get. There. <laughs> no. Is the volcano done? Can I leave? I don't know. I don't want to get out. Jake, I'm checking the outside. Oh, it's too dangerous. Don't go. Looks fine out here. I mean, I was ready to survive the next 24 years. I know we're out Like of this? Well, I'm just gonna just, you know, ration it out day by day. But if it's safe to go, I mean, we could go outside. Kinda gonna miss this place. All right, well, let's head to the entrance and open up, see how the world is. Time to depressurize the front lock and let us out of here. Let's see what's happened to the world in 24 hours. And hand scan. Okay, here we go. First door is open. All right. Okay, open finally, the final door. finally I got out of here. All right, in three, two, one. Whoa. Logan? It's the future. Jake, what do you mean it's the- Jake, what do you mean it's the future? It's the future, bro. What do you mean? This place looks the exact same. They've got hoverboards! Logan, we have traveled through some sort of time paradox, and we are now in the future! Just look at everything. It's all shiny and new. Literally nothing has changed down here. Logan, everything has changed. The volcano must have done this. Well guys, we don't have enough time to explore in this video, but let us know down below if you'd like us to continue this series. And of course, do not forget to hit that subscribe button as well as the like button. But guys, this has been Papa Jake and Bunker Logan. And we'll see you guys next time for another awesome video.